Dear Reeves, I hope you are all, fi all fine. This ultrasound video shows a case of pleural effusion. You can see a large amount of fluid is seen in the pleural cavity. This, uh, this fluid is called pleural effusion. The fluid seen in this case, the fluid seen is exudate fluid. Ultrasound allows the detection of small amounts of pleural lacular fluid with positive identification of amounts as small as 3 to 5 ml that cannot be identified by radiograph which is only capable of detecting volumes above 50 mm 50, 50 ml of liquid. You can see the the movements of the collapsed lung tissue inside the pleural effusion inside the pleural fluid with respiratory movements tuberculous pleural effusion is one of the most common forms of extrapulmonary tuberculosis tpe usually presents as an acute illness with fever, cough, and pleuritic chest pain, the pleural fusion is an exudate that usually has predominantly lymphocytes. You can see the ascitic fluid is also seen in this patient. The fluid seen in between the diaphragm and the liver is ascitic fluid. when the fluid seen in the pleural cavity is the pleural effusion. You can see the collapsed lung tissue is moving with the respiratory movements. This is the collapsed lung tissue. You can see its movements with the respiratory movements. The pleural fluid in this case is exudate that usually has predominantly lymphocytes. The sonographer may evaluate the images for internal ecogenicity of the effusion, thickness of the pleura and associated parenchymal lesions of the lungs. There are two types of effusion, effusions that can could be distinguished on the basis of sonographic findings. Transudates or an echoic and an echoic infusion can either be a transudate or exudate pleural effusion with complex septated complex non substrated or homogeneous ecogenic patterns are always exudate finding of thickened Pleura and associated parenchymal lesions in the lungs are indicative of exudate. Homogeneous ecogenic effusions are due to hemorrhagic effusion or empyema. Evidence of pleural nodule is a specific sign in patients with malignant effusions. Now you can see the free fluid is also seen in the lower abdominal cavity. Free fluid was also seen along the hilum of the spleen again you can see the picture of the patient in the prone position you can see the movements of the collapsed lung tissue with the respiratory movements, the collapsed lung tissue is moving to and fro in the pleural fluid. This is the collapsed lung tissue. 
in this patient only the there was right pleural effusion left side of the lung was clear thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video please click the like button thanks